Hey, hey, good people. Welcome to episode two of The Shit You Lose When You Betray White Supremacy. I'm bringing you another example of a type of privilege that you're going to lose once you get on this path to liberation. And that privilege is the privilege of thinking that your anti-oppressive journey should be private. Those days over with, baby. <laughs> no, no, because the worst thing, right? The most detrimental thing that happens on this path of liberation for folks who hold the most privilege, i.e. white folks, um, is this idea that there is no space for accountability. There is no space for an opportunity for the folks around you who have to be in community with you, who are taking this journey with you to know and to understand and to be able to give feedback. We're going to need a feedback loop, baby. We need a feedback loop system so that we are all on one accord. And that is what training like the anti-oppressive supervision does. It actually creates the infrastructure for a transparent dialogue so that we can see the intersection of vulnerability, humility, and accountability in action. Mm. 